coming to the concept of how what is a reverberation tongue. Now let us consider there is a room. Okay, there is a source of sound, and you are there to listening to this speaker. Now let us assume this room is a new studio room which is not yet furnished. You have taken up this studio. You will listen to the sound. So one is a direct sound. We have a, re a reflector sound R1, R2, R3. Like that there will be multiple reflected sound based on the single sound that was generated. Now what is a conventional method people used to do is they used to just cover the wall. Okay, I need to do acoustics for this room and they try to put some uh, absorption material around this room. Most of the sound that you are going to listen is only the direct sound and whatever the reflected sound is going to be absorbed. Okay, so these are two extreme conditions, right? One, this we call it as a reverberant room. Yeah, reverberant room or echoey room, right? This room, we call it as a dead room, right? This is a dead room. Now, which is the right type of room? Neither this nor this, right? Now, what is reverberation time? Now, let me explain what is the concept of reverberation time is. RT60 is equal to 0.161 volume divided by A. So, what are these? Okay, this is also called as a Sabine's equation. Yeah, so RT60 is related to the total absorption. What is A? Now, RT60 is measured in seconds. So, unit is in seconds. Now, A is a total absorption. Total absorption inside the room. Okay, total absorption inside the room. And what is V? V is the volume of the room in meter cube okay this is how it is related so uh, what is a in the previous uh, lecture you have studied a is equal to the sum of s times alpha where s is the surface area yeah let us uh, call it as x uh, s x and alpha x so s is the surface area of a specific surface of a specific material and alpha is the absorption coefficient of that particular material. This reverberation time is dependent on frequency. That means the RT60 value for different frequency, the RT60 values are different. So what will be the RT60 value in second? Here, let us assume that here um, it is totally reverberant. Where, whereas here it is a dead room. Maybe the dead room, the RT60 value, say 0.1 or 0 0.05 seconds, like that. So, which means it's totally absorbed. And in this room, what will be the RT60 value? Ro approximately, maybe about, depending on the size of the room, yeah, 2 to 3 seconds. Now, these are the two extremes, so which, we, which is both are not desirable. So, which is the ideal thing? Ideal thing is somewhere in between. The purpose of doing a room acoustic treatment is to have a different types of material like absorption panel, diffusion panel, low frequency, LF absorber or base traps. So combination of all these panels put together inside a room is going to determine the right type of reverberation time. 